My name is Aditya Madhavan. I go by Deech. It's my nickname and everyone just calls me that. I am from the Atlanta region. Been doing this since 2008. And this is my lovely 2019 Honda Civic Type R. Autocross is such a visual sport. Everything we're doing out there is based on us looking ahead, trying to find the best line through the course, and having these cameras allows us for instant feedback right through solo storm and race capture to figure out who's driving what line. And if we're you know, two feet away from the cone versus a foot versus six inches, that can make a very big difference in time when you add up all those cones out there. So it's super important to be able to see how close we're getting and the lines that we're doing out there on this course. So we've got two cameras on the car right now. This camera is kind of our prime one. It's connected via Wi-Fi to our solo storm and race capture data setup. So that allows us to pull video between runs, compare lines and overlay our data traces for throttle, speed, acceleration and so on, right with the video itself. So we can always have a very quick comparison to see who's driving what line, what line is faster and, and kind of go from there. The camera we've got on top of the car is a Garmin Verb Ultra 30. And that is gonna be just for course video. And we're just using that so that when our lady co-drivers run in the afternoon, they've got some wide angle video to be able to kind of see the course and see what's going on from there. Our camera on the side is great for uh, seeing driver inputs because you can see our hands on the wheel. You've got a really good view of cones on this side of the car, obviously not on the other side but it's great to see how close we're getting and kind of uh, extrapolate how, how well we're doing even with the other side of the car too. The one on top, you don't get that kind of detail, but you get a better view of the course overall. So that's why we've got the two cameras set up. You know, immediately we'll be using it just for feedback right here at the event itself. Right through, our, we've got a little Amazon Fire tablet in the car. After the event, I'll pull the full high resolution from the camera itself right onto the tablet, it processes it, and then I can upload from there right to YouTube or Instagram or Facebook or wherever else needs it. But yeah, that's typically where it ends up and it's just kind of a cool souvenir to have after the event. <laughs>